Hi everyone, welcome back to Transformers Toys for Kids. I want to give a big shout out and thank you to Hasbro for sending me all of these Earthspark toys to check out. First up with the Tacticons, let's see, they sent us Optimus Prime and Wheeljack. Ooh, that's a brand new one. All right, next up with the Flip Changers, let's see, who do we have? Breakdown, he looks a lot like the Wheeljack Flip Changer, so he's brand new. We have Optimus Prime, Terran Twitch, and of course, Megatron. Up next, we have our three Warrior Class characters who all have a fun gimmick to them. Shockwave, which is new to me, Terran Thrash and Optimus Prime, who I featured on the channel before. And then four big deluxe class characters. Starscream, that's new to me. And then Bumblebee, who I actually haven't featured on the channel before. Optimus Prime and Terran Twitch. So let's organize them by all the ones that I haven't featured on the channel yet. Here we have Breakdown, Bumblebee, Wheeljack, Starscream, and Shockwave. Breakdown and Wheeljack are the two brand new ones that just recently came out. So we'll have to open them all up and check them out. The Earthspark toys are unboxed and ready to go. I think we should start with the Flip Changer and the Tacticon and then move our way on up to the Warrior and Deluxe class characters. Starting off small with Tacticon Wheeljack. If you've seen some of my other videos, you know that they all have wheels that make them roll and minimal paint, they're under five bucks. But the fun part is this little transformation here. Give it a squeeze and they pop open. They've got little arms and then legs. And you can slide on your finger and pretend it's a finger puppet. So they're fun little cheap fidget toys, if you will. So we have Wheeljack, who else? Hashtag. We have RC, I really like hashtag and RC. And then we have Megatron, who else back here? He stands up really well because of his blades. We have Bumblebee, of course. And finally, we'll squeeze Optimus Prime in on the other side. That gives us now six Tacticons for our collection. I hope they come out with more. Next up, we have Decepticon Breakdown. He is a flip changer. He is a lot of fun, just like the rest of the flip changers. They're probably my favorite toys of all the Earthspark toys. You open them up like this, clip them in. You can see the cool design they have for them, although it's just a repeat of what we have on Wheeljack. So the reason that just did that is because I accidentally pressed this button, which helps trigger the transformation. So you can push it like that and it can transform. You can knock him over like this, which I like really cool or you can try to flip him it's really hard because he has to land just right first try pretty impressive all right so that's breakdown let's see what the others can do i think the easiest way to do this would be to knock them all down like i did with breakdown so optimus prime you push him forward and then bumblebee backward and wheeljack is just like breakdown so we push backward and then Swindle forward, just like Optimus Prime. We have a different transformation with Soundwave. His is so fast. I like how he transforms back into his robot mode. So you just push his chest like this. And then we have Twitch. Oh, man, that was quick. Uh, we have Twitch and Megatron back here who both transform the same. So we've got Twitch who goes super fast. Almost looks like she's not even transforming, but I like how they get her to transform back. And then we have Megatron, of course. Megatron might be one of my favorite flip changers. I like him a lot, so watch how he transforms back. Pretty cool. We have, how many do we have? Three, six, eight flip changers in all, and I think they're coming out with even more. I love it. Next up, we have Deluxe Class Bumblebee. He looks just like he does in the show. I think they did a great job with this brand new mold. And I have him next to the Flip Changer and Tacticon version, just so you can see his size. All we're missing now is the Warrior Class version. All right, let's see how Bumblebee transforms. Bumblebee also comes with this weapon that you can attach to his arm, just like this. It can go on either hand, and then you can take that off and you can put it on his back for weapon storage like this. So, pretty cool.
Bumblebee is in his alt mode, and I think I like it better without his weapon on the top, so you can see the racing stripes all the way down. He's got a very unique looking alt mode, and that's why I like it. It's very different from what they've had before. It rolls very well, and if you look on the bottom, ooh, don't look on the bottom. But I love this Deluxe class. I think they did an awesome job with it. Next up, we have Deluxe Class Starscream, and do you notice anything here? Other than the fact that this one doesn't have any null rays? Yeah, they just copied the Cyberverse Deluxe Class Starscream. And even though I like the colors a lot better, they have the Decepticon logo here, they painted over the cockpit area, there's a lot more color to this one. I wish they would have come out with a new mold like they did with Bumblebee. Either way, he still looks really great, has a fun transformation, so let me show you how he transforms. Starscream is transformed into his alt mode. I think he looks great. Yes, we've already seen this before, but I really like the colors. You have the Decepticon logos on the bottom. He's really compact, and I love all the black. The black null rays, all of the black plastic. I think he looks awesome. Last but not least, we have Warrior Class Shockwave. And you can see they really took a lot of paint out of him. I think they're trying to make a, him as close as possible to the show, but I really like all this pink energy running through the original Cyberverse one. Whereas he just has a little bit of silver here and there. That's about it. Even his weapon, which is cool, that fires out like that, it's still purple. Wish it could have been a lighter shade of purple, any other color to make it pop out. Like this one has a pink, energy that comes out of it whereas this new one doesn't but let's get him transformed and see what he looks like in his alt mode And that's pretty much all there is to getting Shockwave into his alt mode. And not too bad. He has this spider-like alt mode, which is cool, and his weapon still works in his alt mode. So you take this little lever and you pull it back like this, like this, let's try it. Ooh, and it fires out. So just one energy, because the other one's stuck back here. That's pretty cool, it can work in both ways. So pull it back, fires out. I like him, I just wish he had some more paint. Well, I hope you enjoyed checking out all these different types of Earthspark toys, from Tacticon and Flip Changer toys, to Warrior Class and Deluxe Class toys. Thanks for watching today, and as usual, be sure to tune back in every week for more fun Transformers toys videos.